late 50s about this thing out there in space because the astronomers were all watching it, and that was back when they weren't afraid to talk about it. It was in the science magazines. I mean, I had a subscription to, like, Popular Science and Health. It was on the front cover of the magazine one day in, like, 1961. And uh, I was really excited when I saw it because here's this giant red planet on the horizon uh, of the California coast and a humongous tidal wave coming in towards the coast and having grew up in the mountains of uh, the Sierras and this thing in the magazine, it said this tidal wave coming in was going to be at least three miles high. And I went and showed it to everybody in the house and they laughed and they said, look, it says right here, there's nothing to worry about. It won't be here for another 50 years. Hey, guess what? That 50 years has came and gone. And uh, this baby's out there in the sky. They've been watching it. I watched it. And I can tell you, this thing has got so much trash coming around it. You know how we live in a solar system? We've got nine planets and a big sun. This right. thing has got seven We're planets. about to have a solar system come through the middle of our solar system. This can't be good. In the southwest, flash floods sparking hundreds of evacuations and water rescues. Phoenix, Arizona averages about an inch of rain in the entire month of August. Yesterday, spots around Phoenix did that in two hours and doubled it. Oh my God. Oh my God. From office windows, panicked New Orleans residents could see the tornado moving into town. I'm freaking out. That's like scary. The swirl of debris a block away from my house coming this way, that kind of looked like a bomb go off. Annual rains have come to Sudan, but this year they've got very heavy, very quickly. Entire villages have been swamped. Roads have been washed away, stranding thousands of communities. People brave the floodwaters by boarding makeshift rafts. Some cling to trees, waiting to be rescued as the water level rises.
Five people yesterday were sent to the hospital after getting struck by lightning at a Poughkeepsie park. One of them has died. They were blue, like, like the sky blue. You know, it was crazy. Unresponsive on the bench and under the tree is how first responders found five people in Mansion Square Park around 4 p.m. on Friday. There was actually smoke coming off one of the guys, actually. You know, one of the guys that was laid out. He was alive, though, but like you could see, like, like he, he was smoking. His, his pants, his clothes were smoking. All five victims were taken to the hospital, three with life threatening injuries. Deadly, deadly flooding in the South, killing at least six people in Louisiana. More than 20,000 people rescued and neighborhoods underwater this morning. A large part of that state facing a flooding disaster. Give me a knife, give me a knife. Watch this dramatic water rescue in Baton Rouge Saturday. I'm tired, I'm drowning. We're coming, we're coming. Volunteers doing all they could as this woman's car filled with water. The rescuers freeing the woman just in time. This was a record event. Even though it was an unnamed storm, it was historic levels of, of rivers uh, and creeks rising. Uh, and I will tell you that we, we've not seen anything like this in the past.
God, there's just an earthquake. There was just an earthquake. I was on my bike. This dog was coming at me. All of a sudden, the dog just stopped in his tracks, looked at the temple, and I felt the ground go up and down. And I look over, and this temple just crumbled. It was like a disaster movie. You know? <laughs> that's like, that's not real. Look at that. Look at that. that. That used to have a top to it, and it fell forward. And look how the whole front of that is just gone. major damage in the Midwest after powerful tornadoes touched down. The line of severe storms hit first in Indiana and then moved over to Ohio late last night. This is just one of the twisters. You can see it's picking up a barn. Oh God, that is hitting that neighborhood. Tornado emergency in Indiana. Mass destruction just outside of Indianapolis. At least eight twisters were spotted. One of the strongest tornadoes struck the community of Kokomo with 165 mile per hour winds. More than six inches of rain falling in the Kansas City area overnight. This is downtown KC right now. The National Weather Service declaring a flash flood emergency. The cars are starting to literally float on the street. This creek turning into a rushing river, rising 10 feet in just 30 minutes, stranding residents. That same system hitting already storm-weary Indiana. Ten confirmed tornadoes there this week, including a devastating EF3 in Kokomo. The Hoosier State normally sees just two tornadoes in all of August. 